morning everybody in youtube land good morning happy father's day um i wanted to blog about an interesting topic that i saw this is actually a response video um it was about lesbians discriminating against other lesbians because they had had sex with a guy before y'all know i have something to say about that so first of all i want to say go to my website www.thefem.yolasite.com Next, hit the subscribe button. Okay. Now to the good part. And I actually had to get a few notes together so that I can rip this article a new asshole with some type of strategy behind it. So, um, this is a response to Southern Comfort. Um, hello. I love seeing people from the South on here because I live in Baton Rouge. So. <laughs> um, uh, this is about the article that she was discussing on her blog. Um, let me basically summarize. First of all, go look at hers. When you go to hers, go subscribe to her page. She has good topics. But, um, just to summarize briefly, um, there was a young lady who posted an article basically saying that lesbians are shunned and uh, looked at as lesser than other lesbians, I guess, who have not been with a man um, before. And I, I personally have never had a problem with this, but I guess. Um, so, okay. My first issue with this, and I have a few, <laughs> is uh, that, you know, her... her pure lesbians theory is pure bullshit that's my first problem with it okay first of all i know a few gold star lesbians they like to call them and they don't have any problem with me because i've had a relationship or i've had sex with a guy before and they don't talk about me behind my back about it it's really not even an issue this seems to be just a little group of stupid close-minded people and that group needs to stick to themselves and leave their, you know, discrimination and bigotry where it is in their little, their little box, that box that I always talk about. Okay. Um, my other problem with this is that if their theory is right, then, um, you know, if, if your first girl or your first sexual experiences were with girls, for the most part, does that make you a lesbian? Uh, one of my best friends her first couple of sexual experiences with girls, her first sex, uh, her first time having sex was with a girl. She's about to move to Florida with her boyfriend and be engaged. And she's grown. She's 27. She knows who she is. She knows where she's been. And, you know, she's bisexual. Um, she knows that she likes to play with girls or she, she likes, she enjoys sex with women. Um, she enjoys relationships with some women but her heart's with men and she understands that and I don't look at her crazy because that's her decision whatever you know but that totally goes against what they're saying you know her first couple experiences with girls should she be a lesbian she's not and she's she's more prone to guys um my third problem with this is how are you gonna sit up here and say, you know, you're, you're so adamant about the fact that you're a lesbian when you don't even know what it's like on the other side. I know, I know with every inch of me that I don't like men. And it's because I've been there and done that. And while I was being there and doing that, I was still having these thoughts for women, still fam fantasizing about women the entire time. That's how I know that I am gay. I know. How do you know if you've never been with a guy? And I'm not just, I'm, I have no problem with gold star lesbians, but I'm just saying, let me just put it out there since it was put on us. You know, how do you know if you were to have sex with a guy, you wouldn't, you know, get addicted, become strictly dickly to the shit and hop on the next dick smoking you can find. You don't know because you've never been down that road. And it also, you know, if it's, if you have been a gold star because that's your choice, that's where life has brought you, that's your journey, that's great. But then there are some girls who are gold stars because they're just like, well, I'm a lesbian. 
okay well how do you how do you know that you've never had sex with a man you've never been in a relationship with a guy he don't know that you don't like that you could have it and then like it but they're they're scared because they 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 know there's actually that little risk factor if they were to have ever tried it maybe they would have liked it so they just avoid it you know but if, if you're a gold star because that's where your life's journey is taking you that's awesome you know but don't knock me do not knock me and definitely don't say anything crazy to me about it um you know what's with all the labels why are there so many labels in the gay community we're the main ones talking about our right to be able to want to love who we want to love and we're the main ones tearing each other down in the process when we can start taking each other seriously the straight community will start taking us more seriously and things like prop 8 won't be so fucking outlandish to them so you know stop with all the fucking labels it's childish oh i'm better than you because i'm a gold star whatever <laughs> whatever um you know discriminating against another lesbian because she's had a sexual experience with a guy is no worse than a straight person discriminating on a gay and i said it and it's the truth discrimination is discrimination is discrimination is discrimination period especially when you're dumb enough to discriminate against somebody in your own community you know we have to stick together we have to stick together to get where we want as a community and then you have a few people who choose to be ignorant about certain situations and be close-minded or just try to put themselves on this pedestal for whatever reason i don't know maybe it's like a self-esteem thing you know maybe it's like i'm just gonna make believe i'm better than other people because i've never had sex with a guy before Okay, if that's what you need to make you feel better, I'm going to pat you. Go on ahead, boo-boo, hug. Everyone, look at the angry gold star in your 10-mile radius and go give them a hug and tell them it's going to be all right. Okay, anyways, that's just my response. <laughs> uh, you know, that's stupid. Stop discriminating. That's, that's childish, really. That's not even, and the, and the person who said it wasn't even like a credible source, like, oh, well, since I read this or I heard this, that's what I'm going to say too. Hey, hey, how about you form your own opinions? Think for yourself. Anyways, uh, thanks for uh, checking out my response video. Let me know what y'all think. Um, and go subscribe and then go subscribe to Southern Comforts, okay? Y'all have a good morning and I'll be back shortly with... Um, Blogs that came from the top of my little head. <laughs> Bye.